Okay, so 21s. I think I've shown this before. I may have done them in some of my workouts in the past. I just don't think I've ever really talked about it. So if I have, this is just a redo. New outfit, new information. So anyway, 21s are a really old school bodybuilding exercise that are for the biceps. It happens to be one of my favorite bicep exercises because it's what creates that peak, that pop in the muscle that you get, that little bump, I guess is the lay term for that. Um, anyway, it's a super simple concept. 21 curls, three sets of seven. You're gonna go from a full curl to a half curl up and then a half curl down or down and up, whichever order you think of as you're doing these. Okay, so I'm just gonna demonstrate it for you and you should have it at that point in time. Um, you can do this with dumbbells, you can do it with a bar, um, but take my form notes because there are some things that people can do really, really wrong that will take away from the exercise. So, I have my dumbbells here, obviously. Form is the number one issue. So you want to make sure that you're not hunched over. You want to be standing up nice and tall. Put your shoulder blades down into your back. Deep navel to spine. Soft knees. Soft hips so you're not tucked under here. Good? This is your first starting point for pretty much any exercise so that you're already set up in good posture. And so we're going to go ahead and start with seven full bicep curls. Now full curl sounds obvious, but a lot of people actually stop a curl too early. So you're going to go seven times all the way up and then all the way down to a straight arm. Two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Now I'm going to go up to a half curl, meaning I'm going to stop at a 90 degree angle. Now you can see there, I don't know if you can see there, that the muscle sort of has that little break at the bottom. Which one's better to look at? This one. There's that little break at the bottom there. That's what we're developing here. So you're going to stop at half and then go down, and then stop at half, and go down. Now the fear for most people, or the problem with a lot of people, is that they let their shoulders go here. And that's taking away from the exercise. It seems like it wouldn't because it's so minor, but if you're here, you're gonna get a lot more out of it. I don't know how many I did. Let's say this is five, six, and seven. Always take a moment to pause there to get that muscular contraction. Now we're gonna go up to the top, and then go back down to half. Same thing like you're holding a tray. One, up, two, up, three, up. Again, don't let the shoulders go. Keep your shoulders lifted. Four, five, six, and seven, and then rest. And even though I'm only using six pound dumbbells, I can already feel a pump in my biceps, and it's just from that concentrated contraction. So have fun with those. I tend to do like three, four sets per workout, especially if I'm doing a focused back and biceps workout. I love them. Hopefully you do too. Thanks.